Hello, my name is Tanisha and I am here with Plaid and we are talking Bucilla today. So, I know you know what Bucilla is, but for anyone who doesn't, um, it is one of our oldest brands. It's 150 years old. So we have been making these awesome kits to make things like stockings and ornaments and other gorgeous things for your house for 150 years, which is pretty amazing. So I'm gonna go through um, this month, next month, and the next month's releases. Uh, so every month we release special designs that you can buy, and, uh, and we're gonna go through those today. So the good news is that if you go to plaidonline.com, you can get 40% off a $100 purchase of Bucilla. So that means if you go and spend a hundred bucks, you're going to get it for $60 and you'll see there's going to be a ton of stuff you're going to want to order because the new stuff is awesome. So we're going to start with January. So I've got Steven here with me. Steven, if you want to go ahead and go overhead, sure. we will start talking about January and um, our, our most popular kits are our stocking kits. So I will talk about that first and I'm going to lift one up each uh, I'm gonna lift each one up so that you can see all the details so this one is called the perfect nap stocking and perfect is spelled with a purr because he's holding a cute cat in his lap oh and he also has another cat up here on his chair and that's, two more at the bottom <laughs> that's something that's always blown me away about Bucilla stockings is that like you get the premise of it and then you find all the little hidden details in yeah. there that you wouldn't see the first time you look at it. Yeah, it's almost like, um, what do they call those in video games and stuff, like the hidden... Uh, like Easter eggs. Easter eggs. I was yeah. going to say the hidden egg, but... Yeah. <laughs> the Easter eggs, yeah. So um, so this one is, is really cute, um, especially if you are a cat family and you can customize every stocking with a uh, person's name, which is really fun. So that was a perfect nap. And this next one is uh, Dear Santa. And so you can see the kids are putting an envelope to mail to Santa, um, probably their wish list. This one's really cute. It's got nice uh, little puffy snowflakes in here, really nice colors. I love the dimensionalness, that, yes. if that's a word, like his hand kind of, you know, popping mm -hmm. off and then like the, uh, the envelope uh, sort of not just being behind yes. the mailbox looking like and it's it actually it. it actually pops out too oh, which cool. is fun I didn't even know that yeah and you could kind of pretend to close the the mailbox there and it's yeah this one is very dimensional yeah it's really fun all right and this next one let's see this is called let it snow and the fun thing about this one is it has these little hanging uh, snowflakes and they're, they are little individual hanging snowflakes, which is really cute. And if you're a, a big Bucilla fan, you probably noticed this about this one already, but it comes with uh, bugle beads towards the bottom. Uh, That's which right. a lot of our stockings do not come with that type of bead. Yeah, and let me see if I can get it close up. So you see those long beads gives a nice extra, extra sparkle. Yeah. And this one has some really fine embroidery here. Really nice details on this one. And not just the name, but also a little let it snow at the top there. Super cute. Very cute. And this one, this let it snow um, theme also has an ornament pack, which is fun. So you get a four pack there. And these also have the bugle beads, you can see. These ones are extra, extra shiny. These are great ornaments. Yeah. And so you get the four pack there and you can match those with your stocking. And then it also has a matching um, door stopper. And this has the individual snowflakes and the uh, scarf that does what you were saying you liked in the other ones. It moves and uh -huh. uh, it's, really, it's really just a little scarf on his neck. And it's got this beautiful blue bird. I didn't even notice that. I really like that little bird. Yeah. It's, uh, I love that it's the same color as the scarf, too. It yeah. all kind of is very cohesive. And so this guy is weighted, so he, he actually acts as a door stopper. Awesome. Which is nice. And it's got this pretty let it snow down here. And um, I, I have done a little bit of embroidery in my life. Uh, I don't know if I know all the stitches, 
but I see that this one has um, some French knots in it at the end of each uh, letter to create a little, a little bit of texture and a little bit of sort of fun there. So that is the stockings and uh, those kits, but then we also have something that I'm very excited about because I love plants. I have far too many plants in my house, but these are the holiday house plants. And I was just looking at these online. I think these are so cool. So it's got a bunch of different kinds of plants. So a classic um, cactus that's flowering, which is really nice and sometimes happens in the winter that way. I love that on the cactus, uh, if you hold it up against uh -huh. Tanisha, you can see the individual little spikes. Yes, there. you're right. That is really cute. Yeah. That's fun. And I don't know, I'm sure it says in the pack what, what kind of plants these all are. I recognize the cacti. <laughs> but they all look a little bit festive. They're all a little bit shiny. This one's cute. Yeah, all of the uh, pots they come in are just slightly different from each other. Yeah, slightly different. Patterns, different. Different colors. Yeah. That might be a snake plant. Oh, I thought it was aloe. Oh, it could be aloe. Yep, you might be right. I like that pot. Yeah. And then another cacti, but a different kind. So that's a really cute um, set. I think this one would be good. You know, someone who's getting into embroidery, maybe a teenager, um, that would be a really fun kit to give as a gift. I like the uh, hanging plant a lot. Oh, did I? I didn't even show him, did I? There you go. And I was saying earlier, it looks a little bit like an uh, octopus. Yeah. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> but he has a little tassel. That, he's the only one that has a tassel on his uh, pot there. He's special. He is special. <laughs> and then here, I'm just going to pull this out of the way here so we have a little bit of room. We've got, what, let's see, what was this kit called? This one is called Believe in Santa Ornaments. So it's individual letters. And the fun thing about this kit is usually our kits are four or six ornaments, but this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ornaments in this kit because the letter, the, the word is longer and it comes with a Santa. So this is a special kit. Um, if you normally buy our ornaments, you will see and know that this one has extra. So this is really fun. And uh, someone was telling me today that one of the things you can do with this kit is take out the eye and put in the Santa for the eye, which is really cute. Oh, that's fun. Um, or, of course, you can leave in the eye and use the Santa for anything else. And he's a cute little standard Santa Claus there. Nice and shiny. And these are nice, nice letters. Yeah, they're, uh, they're pretty firm. Too. They are firm, they yeah. They don't feel flimsy. Yeah. They, they're like stuffed uh -huh. to perfection. Yeah. So they that is good. everything in our January release. Yep. If you guys are watching at home, we'd love to know what you are the most excited for, which design you liked the most. Uh, let us know in the comments what you guys think. Yeah, and so we're going to take away the January and I'm gonna put out February here. And you'll start to see them before I talk about them. There's definitely some fun ones in this month. And let's talk stockings first again. So we are gonna go a little bit backwards. I'm gonna go right to left on this one. So this one is a funny stocking. This one is called Fireplace Folly. And the reason is that Santa Claus, poor Santa Claus, is <laughs> falling down the chimney. He, he went down the wrong way and is falling through the chimney. And again, you can see these really cute, there's really fun stitches in this one. We have some French knots here, um, this really cute uh, rocking horse, a bunch of different gifts. And the name tag, instead of being up on top, is this nice tag here, which is fun. And then embroidered with the name. I love his expression on his face. <laughs> <laughs> he looks surprised. Yeah, he's definitely <laughs> caught off guard. He's starting his uh, night of delivering presents off to a yes. lucky start. 
So this one, this one's really fun to look at because there's just so many different pieces to it. The candy canes, the different presents, and the pre the, this gift looks three-dimensional, which is really cool. You have more, more gifts. That's a fun one. And I do like this nice, nice heavy name tag. It feels, um, it's, again, it's not flimsy. It has, feels like it has like cardstock in there. So it's not gonna get wrinkly. You're not gonna have to um, steam it when you take it out of the Christmas box. And the cool thing about all of these and about Bucilla is all of this stuff is so um, heirloom worthy. Mm -hmm. You can give these things, you know, when your kids move out and have their own kids, they're gonna remember these stockings and they're want, gonna wanna continue using them. They're just so, they're such high quality. They're so detailed. They're beautiful. So this one, let's see, this one is called Snowy Retreat. So this one is nice if you have a blue theme in your house, if you're not doing the reds and greens. This one's really pretty winter wonderland style. Um, just a very simple, cute woodland theme. Obviously that deer is the star of the show. Here. Yes. <laughs> the way he like pops off is... Uh, yes. Again, and the little bunny tails, super yeah. cute. Very dimensional again. Mm -hmm. That's very nice with the little house. All right, and this one released in will be released in February. This is, oh shoot. It, I think one? the name will be on the back. Oh, you're right. This one is the Light Up the Holidays. So I believe the reason it's called Light Up the Holidays is because he has this lantern here. And this is sort of a really classic Christmas vibe to me. Like this right here. This is very, this is my Nana's house all the way. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he's got his lantern, he's got his candy cane. Yep. He's, uh, I like the snow, like, sitting on the top of his hat there. Oh, yeah, that's pretty. Yeah. Those are nice little beads there. And, you know, um, we were told what these beads were called, and I don't quite remember, but they're, they're little round gold beads, and apparently we do not have those in many kits, so that's, that's interesting for this kit. Yeah, our Bucilla experts watching at home will let us know. Yes. <laughs> Oh, and there, there are some round beads, too, in here, so that you'll see them again there. Very nice. All right, and then we have Holiday Glitz. And again, this is a nice one if you don't do the red and green classic Christmas theme. Um, I could see this in a really, really elegant setting. This, is, this one's gorgeous. My mom would like this one, I think. The muted green, the ivories, this is really, really pretty. And this one is, has a much more uh, grown-up feel to it, so maybe you're making one for grandma or aunts. This is one that a, uh, someone who is not a child in your life would very much enjoy. Yeah, Gabby says that that one is stunning. It is, it's, it really is. Let me get sort of close to it. You can see how much detail there is. And it's nice because it, there is a lot of detail, but you can tell that it wouldn't be um, the hardest one to make, I feel like, you know? Right. So you get a lot, of, a lot of beauty out of that one for possibly not too, too much work. All right, let's slide those out of the way. And then I've got, oh, you know what? I had some ornaments that went with that one, actually. Let's pull those out. So we've got, what did I call that one? Holiday Glitz. So we have the Holiday Glitz ornaments as well, which again are just really elegant, really beautiful in those nice muted colors. Um, again, my mom would love these. Maybe I should buy this kit and get crafting. These are really pretty. Let me see, I'll hold one up that has a lot of the beads on them. So there you have those round beads again. Some nice stitches. And those different colors. It's, these are really, really pretty. Yeah, as far as color schemes go, I think I am really partial to this one. I like mm. the uh, sort of like muted, uh, more yeah. neutral colors. And that almost berryish color is a really nice yeah. highlight in there. 
Yeah, our designers uh, on the Bucilla team uh, blow me away every time we do one of these drops where we show yeah. off everything. I'm like, gosh, how did you, how do you just, you how know, do you come up with these? Honestly, <laughs> it's pretty amazing. All right, and then let's see. I think we have a lot of fans of that last set. Oh, good. All right, so this is kind of a fun, um, a fun one. This would be fun for. Um, a kid maybe in um, elementary school that you're crafting for. This is called the holiday dress up ornaments. So these ones, what you do is you craft this little frame and then you stick their picture in it. So it looks like they are wearing the uh, snowman hat, they are now a uh, reindeer, so on and so forth, an elf. So these are kind of funny. My kids love um, when people give us ornaments with their faces in them. I was going to say, Tanisha, I bet this would remind your kids of like going on vacation somewhere. Yes. And like uh, doing like those things where you stick your face in yeah, the Yeah, in the booth. hole, yeah. 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 Yeah, so these are, this would be really fun to craft for um, your grandchildren for sure. And they're not without details. Um, you know, this one, this one's really pretty. It's got a nice sparkle to it. So that is a fun little kit. Again, that's the um, holiday dress-up ornaments. And you stick a picture in those. And then let's talk about spring for a second. We have the butterfly bliss wreath. So this is really, really funky, really fun. And um, our Bucilla expert, who was down here a little bit ago, said that we also have, if you go on our website, we also have ornaments and uh, other items that match this wreath. So apparently this is not our first, first Butterfly Bliss uh, product. So you can find other things that match this. And if you have purchased these in the past, now this one is out, this wreath. So this is pretty amazing. Can you imagine the sun hitting this on your springtime doorstep? That is sparkle mania. That monarch, that monarch is so pretty there. This is really fun. This reminds me, uh, if we have any uh, Georgia locals going to Callaway Gardens. Yes. Going to the butterfly rooms. Yeah. Yeah. It's almost like a mix of something like Callaway Gardens and something like uh, the light shows at the botanical gardens. Yeah. It's almost a mix of that because it's like all the little lights uh -huh. creating. Yeah, I, know. I love like when you tilt it like that, you can really see how those wings pop off. Yeah. The, uh, oh, yeah. I mean, if you look at it from the side, these these um, butterflies are individual butterflies. So really, you know, you could kind of almost bend them up and, and make them really pop off once you hang it somewhere. It's really pretty. I'd like to wear this one on my head. All right, and then I think that's it for that month. So that was February. Yeah. And I'm going to hand that box to Stephen, and he's going to give me the March box. And now that we've talked about spring for a second, we're going to go back into Christmas. Because really, if you have a big plan to craft for Christmas, you might as well start now, right? That's right. <laughs> so especially with like how intricate some of these yes. Bucilla projects are, it might, might, might take you that long. Yeah, it might take you a minute. <laughs> it's like those um, the memes that come out right after Christmas that say you have 364 days until Christmas. Yeah. Start prepping. <laughs> uh huh. Okay, so this is the March drop, and let's see. We start with this one over here, which is the holiday horse ride stocking. <laughs> Michelle said, uh, we are all going to have no money left in the bank when these <laughs> kits come out. Well, good, good news for you, Michelle, is we have a sale going. Yes, 40% off on platonline.com. So go over there and pick out your uh, Bucilla kits. So again, holiday horse ride. So um, Santa, instead of on a sleigh, is on a horse, which is fun. And it sort of looks like a horse from a, um, oh gosh, what's that ride called? A carousel. Yeah. It's a carousel horse. I'm a big fan of the uh, teddy bear in the back. Yeah, he is cute. 
Makes it a little bit movable. He's, do, he's doing arm. a great job. Yeah. <laughs> and Santa's little mittens can move and sort of say, you know, come on, horse. Can steer. And these have these fun, um, it's almost like a confetti uh, snowflake that are sewn on here and they're iridescent. So that one's fun. You can see some of the details. This one is another one of those very three-dimensional stockings filled with um, polyfill in there so that you really get a three-dimensional look to this one. All right, and then we have festive winter birds. I, I really kind of like this one. I'm a, I'm a bit of a bird watcher. I keep my bird feeders full. It, it almost tells a story like they're having a conversation. Yeah. You know, like the ones up top talking to the one down at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Like, should we take the stuff out of this stocking? <laughs> should we? And if you're, if you're from Georgia, we see these guys a lot. Yeah. A whole lot. And I love, love, love these tiny, teeny, tiny little trees on the stocking. Oh, wow. And you have a stocking on a stocking, which is fun. These details, man. It is. Very, very detailed. And these ones, these are stitched snowflakes instead of like the last one where it was um, uh, almost a three-dimensional snowflake. These ones are stitched and it has an ornament, birds. Again, always personali per pers hmm. personalized. personalized with a name. That's a, that's a fun one. It's a nice yeah. color too. All right, and then we have poinsettia bells stocking. So this is sort of a classic poinsettia um, color combo with the dark red, red, and the greens. And you have your really nice poinsettia in the middle there. And again, here's another one of these, um, uh, these name tags that are nice and thick. And it hangs off to the side, which I think is a really fun detail. And this, I love this bow. It really pops off there. Mm -hmm. Looks like a real bow on top of the bells. This one's pretty, very classic Christmas, Christmas look. And the bells here are, have a little bit of polyfill in them, so they do, they do puff off a little bit. That one's pretty, I feel like this one is something, looks like something you would buy in the store for $60 at least. And then, let's see, and then we have, oh, you know what? I missed our ornaments, but I'll go back. So then we have Peppermint Santa. <laughs> Take a guess why he's called that. <laughs> <laughs> he's got a number of different kinds of mints. And uh, this, instead of a name tag, we have a, a cup of hot cocoa, which is fun. And I will pull out the ornaments in a second, and you'll see that this actually goes with an ornament set as well, which is really fun. I like that he's got uh, the mints under his belt, too. Yeah. Uh, you know, <laughs> Just in like, case. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and his, I like how his bag is embroidered. It looks like an actual embroidered yeah, bag, which is pretty. fun. So let me pull out the ornaments that go with him, and then I'll have to backtrack and show you some other ornaments. So these are, let's see. These are all the little cups of hot cocoa that go with this stocking, which is a really fun idea. So this, these are the cozy Christmas um, ornaments and the cozy Christmas stocking. So these go together um, if you wanted, excuse me, if you wanted to buy both kits. And again, the person who was down here um, talking to us about all the kits, let me know that the, there's two, you see here, there's two different green cups, but in the kit, you actually just choose to make one cup. It comes with either the brown, um, uh, what are these guys called, not deers? Uh, reindeer. Reindeer, thank you. <laughs> I was drawing a blank too. <laughs> a brown reindeer or a white reindeer. And apparently the white reindeer is considered a vintage look. So that's why they put both in there, but you would just make one of those cups. And then the rest are individual designs. Um, but apparently they had gotten some feedback about the white and brown reindeer, so they include both for you to choose. And then in some of the cups, you can actually see that it is um, hot chocolate in there and you can see the marshmallows poking mm -hmm. out. 
candy cane handles are a nice touch. The too. candy cane handles, yes. And sparkly as always. Very cute. I do like the, the marshmallows. This one's adorable. This one reminds me of um, Chip from Beauty yeah. and the Beast. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so that goes with those guys. And then I'm gonna backtrack a little bit because one of my favorite kits I missed to talk about with the horse. Uh, this was called Holiday Horse Ride Stocking. And we have a whole kit of holiday horse ornaments, which I adore. So I have a few horses on my tree, but they are made out of metal. And I would love to put some of these embroidered guys. Look how pretty this one is. Yeah, that one's awesome. I love his, uh, his stance that he's in his pose. Yeah, and his hair blowing back with the little blue. It's really, really nice. So each one of these is a little bit different. And what did we say? They, were, they look like carousel horses. And when you're on a carousel, they are always all different and in different stances. Oh, and look at this guy. It looks like his little boots make mushrooms. Yeah. Oh, that one has red and green hair. I, yeah, I like how their hair um, is sort of like in action. <laughs> yeah, some, some of them are, are really going for it. So those are the horses. I think those are a really fun little kit. And then last but not least, we have a, uh, it's called Jolly Santa Tree Skirt. So this is a big guy. So this can either be a table topper or a tree skirt. If you want to do a tree skirt, you cut a hole in the center. And this is the main part. So you can see his face is, his, um, his beard and mustache is, is embroidered. It's really, really pretty. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm um, beaded, I guess I would say. Mm -hmm. Let me hold that up a little bit for you. Nice big face with some holly berries there. And then as you spin it around, it has ho, ho, ho in letters and uh, sequins. Sequins and beads. And then all over the whole thing, it has these really pretty little embroidered red um, I guess those would be considered snowflakes. Yeah, little stars, little, little stars. Snowflakes. Yeah. Yeah. And so that is it for the kits. Um, I if do we have any questions, Stephen? I don't know that we have any questions, but we have lots of people saying they uh, love how these looks, uh, how these look, and uh, they are excited. I think, uh, gosh, I forgot the name of it, but in our March drop, that uh, this stocking. Right oh, here. here. Let me let me show that one again since yeah. everyone loved it so much, and we had some. We did have some matching um, stocking kit that went with that one as well. Yeah, that one is a, a personal favorite of mine too, of everything that we've shown yeah. today. This um, one's really pretty. I'm grabbing the ornaments for you right now. so that you And can I wonder, them. other people probably would know, I wonder if that's considered a poinsettia in the center there, Oops. but in white. And I did just notice that these have um, sort of pearl beads yeah. on them as well. Somebody made a comment about that too. Yeah, yeah. so it's not just the, I, I pointed out the gold round beads, but it also has little pearl beads too. Yeah, these are incredibly elegant, really, really pretty. Um, the two sets that go together are so nice. And this would be nice to give, to make the, maybe a new, someone new in the family and then, you know, give one ornament to each person in the family, something like that. It's really, really pretty. So I hope you guys enjoyed looking at all these kits. Make sure you go to plaidonline.com to check out the sale, 40% off a hundred dollar purchase, um, which is pretty amazing. So your purchase will be, you know, about $60. Um, so you're, you can go crazy and get all the kits that you loved during this drop. And we will see you again for the next drop. And of course, um, follow us everywhere. And always please show us your what you're making. We love to see it. So yeah, thank you guys Especially so if, much. You're, if you're finishing up a Bucilla stocking, we'd love to see the end result. We would love to see it, yes. Yeah. So thank you so much and have a wonderful day.